Hey y'all, welcome to Unboxing Discovery by G. My name is Gina, Miss Kelly Cat is sitting down on the other side of the camera. Y'all, I've got a Torrid haul. Um, I've been doing a lot of Torrid shopping lately, and I gotta tell you, I haven't been able to find as much love there as I used to, but I don't, I don't know. Let's just see what I bought. And by the way, I do have another one on the way. So I'm still finding plenty. But if you don't know what Torrid is, they are more of a normal size girl. Yeah, normal. Size 10 to 30. That's normal now. All them size 2s can say that they're the, the normal or whatever, but no, they're not. Size 10 to 30. We're the normals. So, they do focus on us curvier girls, and I do love that. Let's just see what I got, because I don't remember. And this bag has been sitting here for a little while. I just haven't had time to do it yet. So we're going to open it now. Wait, what? Okay. I was like, wait a minute. Because it looked like those swim shorts that I got. Now I remember what I got that day. Okay. Part of it anyway. Is this the right? Yes. Okay. So everything is individually wrapped. Oh, dear. Uh, this is my price sheet. So I'll be able to tell you what I paid and then I'll tell you online what the price of it is because I I normally use Tord Cash. Uh, for every $50 you spend, they give you $25 of Tord Cash. And then within a certain amount of time, you can use that Tord Cash and you're building up more Tord Cash. So you're pretty much getting everything half off. So yay for that. Um, I have well, five items here. Let's just open them up and see what's inside. All right, so here is the first item. I thought this was super cute with the little detail on it. It does give you a little bit of that. It's a fit and flare lace trim cami, textured stretch rayon in dusty rose. I got it in a double zero. It doesn't look like a double zero, but it is. Uh, it's normally $65.50. It has the cute button down the front. It's kind of a fake button. It doesn't actually. Oh, good. So it won't, you know, do that. I love these fit and flares, though. They're very cute. They're, look at that. That's adorable. It feels double lined. It is. It's double lined. So this would be a great end of fall piece. I paid before tax $31.30. By the way, these straps are adjustable. I think it's cute. Callie jumped when I laid that down. She's like, whoa, wait, what was that? Let me see. The inside is polyester for sure. Let's see. The shelf is 99 rayon, one spandex. The lining is 100% polyester. Machine wash coal, gentle cycle, line dry. Cool iron if needed which I could see it need an iron, but I'd probably just hang it up <laughs> and hope that they fell out or use some of that spray stuff because I don't iron. <laughs> All right, next top. So I used to be real picky about keeping the bag with the clothes or making sure that the clothes stay with the bag. I asked the lady when I took it back, like, do I need to do that? And she's like, if it's got a tag on it, you're fine. You don't need to do that. So I'm not keeping them up now. So this is the Tord Classic Fit Tank. Okay, what does it say? When life gives you curve, when life gives you curves, flaunt them. I thought that was rather appropriate for us, for me. You know, it's a cute little shirt. My husband loves the sarcastic type shirts. He wears them all the time. You know, he likes that I got that shirt that says seriously on it from them. And I just think these are adorable. I think Torrid is also where I got that one that says my cat thinks I'm awesome that everybody loves. So very cute. I love that it's a v-neck, nice ribbed collar to it. Very cute. The regular price on this is $32.50. This is a v-neck vintage tank, super soft, slub flaunt in white. I paid $15.54 for it before tax. So I think that's cute. And I'm pretty sure all these slub tanks are easy care. 52 cotton, 44 round, 4 spandex. 
Machine Rush Coal Dental Cycle Tumbler I live. Very cute. Let's plot our curve gel. This is soft. And it is black. And what is it? I'm so confused. What is it? Okay. This is the crochet yoke zip front shirt dress stretch chalice black. $69.50. So I do like the top. It is cute. It does have a little bit of a zipper on the front. Some cute little pockets. And then it's a skirt. It does have an adjustable tie waist here. Also feels like they're there. All right, so maybe there's not a double skirt in here. But there's pockets. Oh, I found pockets. Hello. So I'd have to be careful about the black, but having a little black dress is such an important staple in your wardrobe because they just come in handy. You never know when you're going to need something that's a little more reserved. But this one has a little bit of fun flair to it as well. Kind of has that curved bottom. Double zero, by the way. I think I got everything in double zero. Well, not everything. Everything I've shown you so far. And I paid $33.31 for this. It's very soft. It is 97 rayon, three spandex. The contrast is polyester. Machine wash, cold, gentle cycle, line, dry, cool iron if needed, which I could see it needing an iron. But I love that top. It's just cute. We'll try it on. We'll see how it goes. All right, so this is one of the things that is not in a double zero. I actually got it in a zero because I like these over type shirts to be a little bigger. This is the button front blouse textured stretch rayon black and white gingham. Gingham has been so popular, but it's a short sleeve and I thought it would be a cute little over shirt like you would wear a plaid. So I could tie it, I could you know put it over black tank top or I could wear it like this. I thought it would be cute. And since it is so soft, look at the ruching in the back. Very cute. You know, if I can hold it straight. What do y'all think? Um, $55.50. I did get this one in a size zero. I paid $26.55 for it. It's not any nine round, one spandex, gentle wash, cold, line dry. I think it's cute. And I could throw it over the top of my black bikini top that I'm wearing my gingham shorts with and I would match, very cute. <laughs> I don't know, I think it's, I think it's cute. Um, last thing is a shrug. Now I've been looking for some short sleeve shrugs to wear over things like this when I want to wear a bra but I want to wear my tanks. Um, so, Kelly, you're being so silly. This is a scalloped trim shrug in black. It's a size zero. Since it will be an overshirt, I did go up a size. It's normally $45.50, but it's just a cute little short shrug wear it over a dress you could wear it over a tank like I was saying but it is short you know there's it's a shrug that's how they're supposed to be very soft it is 70 rayon 30 nylon turn it inside out wash cold gentle cycle reshape and lay flat to draw a cool iron if needed what do y'all think do y'all wear shrugs I just wasn't sure about it but I thought I'd give it a try I paid $21.76 for it. So what did you think of my tour at haul? I'm curious to see how everything is going to fit on me and what y'all are going to think of everything. So let me know below. There's all kinds of YouTube buttons for y'all to push now. Please give this video a thumbs up. If you choose to give it a thumbs down, I would really appreciate a comment below letting me know what you didn't like about the video so I can improve. Subscribing to my channel is absolutely free, so I really appreciate it if you would subscribe. 
don't forget to share it with your friends. Also, there's a little share button. It'll help you to put a link on your social media that takes you to this video. There's a super thanks down there. It's like giving me a tip. I really appreciate it if you do that. And don't forget the little notification bell. It'll let you know when I'm putting new videos up. I'll see y'all back in a second with what I'm wearing today and all these clothes. So this is my outfit of the day. I'm wearing this top I got from Torrid. The jeans are travel jeans. And the top I got from Stitch Fix. I think it's a Lux. This came from Rock's Box. This came from Transcend by Ever Eve. And those are from Rock's Box as well. It's John's clothes. So here is my outfit of the day. I am wearing this top I got from Via & Co. My pants are cut from the cloth. Country girl, no shoes. All of my jewelry is from Rock's Box. Well, not this. I can't remember where I got this. I think maybe I did get it from Rock's Box. But anyway, Ginger Scott, I can't remember what brand this is. Yeah, I like the ring. All right, let's move on to the clothes. When life gives you curves, flaunt them. So I think this one shirt is really cute. I love that it is long if you wanted to wear it over some stretchy pants or something, but it's long enough you could give it a French tuck too, and it looks super cute like that. I love their shirts, y'all. They're just so comfy, live-in type of shirts. And I'm going to throw the shrug on over the top of this just so you can see the shrug. Look at how cute that is. I mean, is it really as cute as I think it is? This would be great with a fit and flare kind of dress, or you could wear it over tanks. Uh, if I was gonna wear it over a tank, I probably wouldn't do the French tuck. I probably would do something different. I may even do a full tuck with it, just to give a little more waist. What do y'all think? of that. I mean, you could do a tie. There's so many different things you can do. Ignore the flappies I left because I didn't give it a full tuck. But yes, very cute. I like the shrug. I've been, I've been looking for a shrug, y'all. A good shrug to wear around. And this one is cute. It does have a little poof, but not enough to bug me. It goes up a little high on your neck, but since there's not a collar in the front, that doesn't bug me either. I, I like it. What do you think? Now, I did throw the gingham top on over the other tank. You can see I probably could have sized down in it, but the reason I put it on like this is so you could see it buttoned, and then I'm going to unbutton it with the tank. It's cute. I think it's pretty cute. Now let me unbutton it and show you how more than likely I'll wear it. This is probably how I would wear it. With a graphic tee underneath, unbuttoned, give it a little tie. It doesn't have to be anything fancy. Of course, there's all them fancy things you can do with your belt loops and such and make it look cuter, but if you don't want a tie in the front, but I, I think it's adorable. It's comfy. Bonnie Faye, I'm tangled. You be a good girl. I'm so tangled. My hair was all tangled up in this tag. I did want to show you the back of the shirt. By the way, I probably do not have that hanging. So what do y'all think? I'm gonna try those dresses on now. So here's the little black dress with pockets, huge pockets by the way, huge. I could lose my whole arm in these things. <laughs> um. Cute. I did cinch it a little right here. Of course, you could go to town and cinch it a whole lot more, depending on what your waist allows. Of course, I am the smallest right there, so I could really cinch it. Everywhere else is the bigger parts. <laughs> Which actually looks pretty good. Just adjust it 
to your look. If you want to go more risky, you can unzip what I know. <laughs> But I think it's adorable with this cute little pattern. It does give you a little bit of a plunge right here. It's just a great everyday dress. You could dress it up with a cardi or something with a fun boot. I have a um, white and black leopard print boot in mind <laughs> in my closet. All right, so let me know what you think. I got one more dress to try on. My apologies, it's not a dress, it's a top, but it is super cute. You can wear it with leggings, you can wear it with jeans like this. I, I don't know, when they floof out like this, I tend to want to wear more of a tight leg. I just think it balances out better. I don't know why, is that just a me thing? I do think it's fitting a little strange right here, but it's cute. And it would look cute under a denim jacket. I may have to get me a steamer, y'all, because I'm not, I'm, I refuse an iron, but it's so cute with the little eyelet detail down here and up here. It's got the little double layer. Very huge. Great transition piece for layering, which is what I love to do. All right, let's do a recap. So this was a pretty good haul, y'all. I mean, haul, y'all, haul, 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 y'all, y'all, haul. I'm getting to that uh, point of tired where I'm a little giggly. I don't even know if I want to send anything back. Um, after tax and everything, I only spent a hundred and thirty-seven dollars and fifty cents for what did I? One, two, three, four, five items which is about what I like to spend if I'm doing like a Stitch Fix box, things like that. And I thought everything was pretty cute. I, I like the Flaunt Your Curves shirt. It's a great just throw and go shirt or a graphic for underneath something. I like that. Um, speaking of underneath something, I liked the gingham. It was cute. I liked it over the top. I liked it as a wear alone top so i think that's versatile and cute you know i'll get some good use out of the shrug sometimes i wish the shrugs were longer but i think this would accentuate certain kinds of dresses which i just kept a couple of those certain kind of dresses so i'm wanting to keep that this dress shirt this top i do like it but the way this is made, I'm just not 100% sure on it. So if I take anything back, it may be this top. For $31, if I have to run by Torrid, I may take this back. I think it is super cute, but if I'm unsure of it, will I reach for it? So I don't know, I may take that one back. This dress I thought was cute. I think it'd be versatile. Uh, I hope you can throw it in the dryer because it is a little wrinkly. No, you line dry it. I need to get one of them handheld steamers, y'all. I think that's what I need to do because I will not iron. I'm scared to death of irons. I'm afraid I'm going to set the house on fire. I'm going to burn the clothes. Something. I'm just not good with irons. That's why I refuse to use them. This was 33 I probably will keep this. Unless y'all say, hey, no, send it away. I probably will keep this for just an emergency um, black dress or I will wear it and put like a colored cardigan or something over the top of it to give it a little color and wear it black with some, you know, fun shoes. Um, there's all kinds of fun things you can do. Uh, so let me know what you think. Man, my hair is looking really rough. <laughs> I keep looking in the mirror and like touching them like, whoop, all them curls and fell apart and went frizzy um let me know below in the comments tell me what you think of the stuff what you think of the haul all that good stuff i want to hear it all and thank you so very much for spending time with me and miss Callie cat who is being antisocial what are you doing huh <laughs> putting my head on her and she's ignoring me Y'all have a wonderful day and God bless.